Welcome welding enthusiasts! In today's video, we have an exciting comparison between two popular welding techniques, ARC and MIG welding. Let's take a closer look at the differences, advantages and considerations of using this for welding methods. So, sit back, relax and let's get started. When it comes to welding, choosing the right technique is essential for achieving strong and reliable weeds. ARC and MIG welding are two widely used methods in the welding industry. In this comparison, we'll delve into the characteristics, performance and suitability for various welding applications. Let's begin by understanding the fundamentals of ARC welding. ARC welding, also known as shielded metal ARC welding or stick welding, utilizes an electric arc to create a high temperature fission between the base metal and the welding electrode. The electrode coated with a flux provides shielding to protect the weld pool from atmospheric contamination. Arc welding is known for its versatility and simplicity. It can be performed in various positions and is suitable for welding a wide range of metals including steel, stainless steel, cast iron and more. Arc welding is particularly effective for welding thick materials and in outdoors or challenging environments. Now, let's shift our focus to MIG welding. MIG welding, also referred to as gas metal arc welding, utilizes a continuously fed wire electrode and a shielding gas to create an arc between the electrode and the base metal. The shielding gas protects the weld pool from atmospheric contamination. MIG welding is highly popular for its speed and efficiency. It offers fast deposition rates and provides excellent control over the welding process. MIG welding is primarily used for welding thin to medium thickness materials and is commonly used in automotive fabrication and manufacturing industries. Let's discuss the welding performance of ARC and MIG welding. ARC welding allows for deep penetration and strong welds, making it suitable for heavy-duty applications. It provides excellent control over the welding process, allowing welders to create precise and detailed welds. However, arc welding may require additional post-weld cleanup and may produce more spatter compared to MIG weld. MIG welding offers faster welding speeds and produces cleaner and neater welds. It provides good control over the weld pool and allows for continuous welding without frequent starts and stops. MIG welding generally requires less post-weld cleanup compared to arc weld. Let's discuss some considerations and applications when choosing between arc and MIG welding. Arc welding requires a higher level of skill and experience to achieve desired results. It may be more challenging to perform in confined spaces or vertical positions. However, it is well suited for heavy constructions, fabrication and repairs of thick materials. MIG welding, although relatively easier to learn, requires proper shielding gas, wear and equipment setup. It may not be as effective for welding thicker materials or in other environments with windy conditions. However, it is widely used in automotive manufacturing, sheet metal fabrication and general welding applications. Both ARC and MIG welding techniques offer unique advantages and considerations. Arc welding exceals in its versatility, strong welds and suitability for thick materials while MIG welding provides faster welding speeds, cleaner welds and ease of use for thinner materials. Choosing between arc and MIG welding depends on factors such as the welding project requirements, material thickness, skill level and available equipment. That wraps up a comparison of arc and MIG welding. We hope this video has provided you with valuable insights into the characteristics, performance and applications of these welding techniques. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and leave a comment below. And as always, stay tuned for more informative content on welding techniques and equipment. Happy welding!